Hello, welcome to my kitchen with an accent. We've already cooked salted homemade caramel with you, but today I'd like to share another method to cook it. As always with the caramel, at the end we will got really delicious sauce, which is perfect for all types of desserts, from the cakes and cookies to an ice cream and the pancakes. First of all, let's prepare all ingredients. Sugar, liquid glucose, heavy cream, water and salt. Following this recipe, you will get about 250 grams of the homemade caramel. Let's get started. Take a medium-sized pot with a thick bottom. Mix there 85 grams of liquid glucose and 85 grams of sugar. Place the pot on medium-high heat and wait while sugar melts. You may only swirl the pot gently if you need to redistribute some sugar. But don't mix it at this point in order to avoid crystallization. If you have a thermometer, heat the caramel to 130 or 150 Celsius degrees. At the same time, bring 120 grams of heavy cream almost to the boil. Liquid glucose, which we use in this recipe, allows to avoid crystallization in the ready caramel, but you can cook the caramel without this ingredient. Obviously, it is in another recipe with different proportion of ingredients, so just follow the links in the description, try all variants and choose that variant which you prefer the most. Now it's time to add hot heavy cream to the melted sugar. If you'd already watched other caramel videos, you certainly would know that the caramel bubbles a lot at this stage, so you should be very attentive and careful. Add heavy cream slowly while whisking vigorously. When you add all heavy cream, Continue cooking the caramel for 2 more minutes or till 130 Celsius degrees. Remove the pot from the heat and let the caramel cool down a little. Now add the butter and mix using a blender until smooth. And now it is the most interesting step. Add 1 or 2 grams of the salt in your caramel. I don't know why, but I really didn't use to like the caramel in general and the salted caramel in particular until recently. But finally I appreciated it so much and now it is one of my favorite tastes. As I've already said, we got 250 grams of perfect and amazing caramel salt. Try to cook it and share your impressions. Good luck and приятного аппетита!